It was a beautiful day to get a little muddy this afternoon. All of sorts of trucks and Jeeps competed to see who could drive through the mud in Lisbon. First News reporter Jacob Thompson has the story. You get to play in the mud and you get to have horsepower. Rev up your engines, it's time to get dirty. This is a mud bog. Uh, guys build trucks with big tires, big suspension, high horsepower, try to get through the mud bog, get uh, as far as you can or as fast as you can out the end. That's simply it. One long pit of mud about 200 feet long with guardrails on each side. People lined up on both sides to cheer on. They can modify them. Some do them uh, street legal. Some of them put bigger tires, bigger motors, but some people just bring their trucks off the street and they go through the pit. It's based off a point system. There are different classes based off tire sizes, but safety is still required. The rules, uh, you have to have a helmet, you have to have face protection, um, and you are allowed to have a passenger, but they also have to have a helmet. Tri-County Four Wheelers puts on different competitions a few times a month. If you get stuck, they'll pull you out. A trophy is awarded at the end of the season, but that's not all. I guess bragging rights would be a main thing, you know. Guy with the biggest horsepower usually gets the furthest, I would say. In Lisbon, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.